do not know which spatula cable you need to use. Well, it's a good job I'm here then. Hello, we are back by popular demand. It's me, George. Welcome to the official Give Energy Battery Cable Guide. We're going to be talking about battery cables, as you'd expect. I'm here today in our chemical lane premises. It's a bit cold. I won't lie to you. Anyway, battery cables can be a little bit confusing. It can seem a lot more confusing than it actually is, which is why I'm here today. So that you need not worry about which cables you need to be plugging in. So without further ado, let's get cracking, shall we? First up, it's the lug to lug cable. So the lug to lug cable. This is our OG battery cable. Used to be the one and only, and it was great. We had a great time with it. Although some people find it a bit tricky to, to connect up. Hence why we moved away from it. You'd use the lug to lug when connecting a Gen 1 or Gen 2 hybrid inverter, or the AC coupled, to a 2.6, this is a lot longer than I was expecting it to be, 2.6, 5.2, .2 or 8.2 hour battery. You could also use it when connecting up a 2.6, 5.2 or 8.2 kilowatt hour battery together in parallel. This comes included with those batteries. I'll say it again, 2.6, 5.2 or 8.2 kilowatt hour batteries. So you don't need to pay any extra for this. They're included in the box. You get them as standard. Moving up, we have the plug to lug cable. Plug to lug is the link between the older generations and the newer generations. So you would use this when connecting up a Gen 3 hybrid inverter to a 2.6, 5.2 or 8.2 kilowatt hour battery. Vice versa, you'd also use it when connecting up a Gen 1 or Gen 2 hybrid inverter or an AC coupled with the newer 9.5 kilowatt hour battery. If you wanted to have a 9.5 with an older generation battery, you'd use this to connect them together. You can have up to five batteries in parallel with any one inverter. I don't know if I mentioned that last time, so we'll mention it here. At the time of recording, you don't get this included in any of the boxes that you'll buy, so you'll need to buy this separately. So just bear that in mind. Moving swiftly on. Last but not least, we have the plug to plug cable. You'd use these when connecting up a Gen 3 hybrid inverter to the 9.5 kilowatt hour battery, or just like everything else, if you wanted to parallel up 9.5 kilowatt hour batteries together, you'd use one of these to connect them together. At the moment, the Gen 3 hybrid and the 9.5 are the only products that we use that would use these connections. That is gonna change in the future, I would imagine. That's not an exclusive, that's just me guessing. But as of recording right now, this is it. It's just those two. That's all the cables. So there you have it guys, three cables, it's as simple as that. I don't know why people get so confused about it. I do, I do, we, we changed the name. We changed the name multiple times, that's why. But not again, never again. Remember, if you ever get confused, just remember your ABCs. Always refer back to the Give Energy Battery Cable Guide. I think that checks, that's all right. If you wanna like and subscribe, it would really help me out when it comes to my annual pay review or just for the love of the brand. But if not, I've been George, you've been you. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time.